Hey guys, this is GG Reactor, and I've been working on my Team Fortress 2 map a lot lately, and I just thought I'd explain to everyone about how you compile the cube maps for LDR and HDR. I'm following this based on a tutorial on the uh, tf2maps.net, so I don't take credit for figuring this out, I guess. I don't know if you figured it out, but you know. So, uh, yeah. First thing you're going to do is open your console. You can enable that through your option menu if you haven't yet. Then you hit the uh, tilde, I think. Something like that. And you type map and then your map name. So in this case, my map name is PL Launch. And then you're going to load your map. This might take a minute. It usually does, but you know. I have a really fast computer too, but you know. Oh, or it's not. Usually it'll just sit there forever and you're like, oh, okay, whatever. And next thing you're going to do is type MAT specular zero. Like that. Then, I guess it was already off on mine, maybe? Because usually it freezes for a second. Alright. Then you're going to type build cube maps. <laughs> and you can watch all your cube maps build. I usually, not usually, I should have more cube maps because the map's a lot bigger than that, but I thought I'd do that more towards the end, so. And then next thing you're going to type is disconnect. After you do that, you're going to type MAT HDR level 0. Then it, I think it always just says not playing a local game, but I still think it works, right? H, yeah, it still works. And then you're going to type map, and then load your map again. <laughs> See, this time it's going to take a second. Not sure why either. I just don't know. <sighs> so, uh... Life's good. Been a good life so far. There we go. And now you're going to build the cube maps again. Then you're going to type disconnect. Now you're going to type MAT specular 1 and then MAT HDR level 2. Oh, there we go. And it, I'm sorry for going so fast on these tutorials. I know that probably gets really annoying, but I'm trying to, you know, give you enough time. I just always forget. And then next thing you're going to do is type map. Oh, you're going to just go to any random map, I guess. So I'll just go to, um, it doesn't really matter what I do. I'll do Badlands. <laughs> it says it's to clear the texture cache. You know, until two years ago, I always called it a cache. I don't know why. C-A-C-H-E. It just seems like to be cache. Don't know, though. I guess cash sounds better. And this is going to take a minute. <laughs> Alright, there we go. And now you can load your map again. Oh. PL launch. Now as we wait for my map to load, there we go. I guess we can just join blue as a scout. And as you can see, don't take this as a what the tutorial does. I screwed up my lighting in here. Let's get them! There's part of my map. But you can see the HDR works kind of good. Though I guess I shouldn't be recording and trying to play at the same time with a million background programs. It's going to slip. And you can see I messed up those two lights too. But you can see the specular works pretty good. I mean, that's probably a cube map from up there somewhere. So it's not going to look that big because I barely do my cube map. Five, four, three, two, 
One. Play ball. And here you can see, kind of. I need to tone these lights down so you can. You know. Anyways, I know you don't care about my map. You just want the tutorial. So this pretty much just shows it works. The specular maps on the floor and everything work pretty good. And thanks for watching.